Oh yo yo what's up this is your boy Chris right here so in today's news um, I just checked up the Warriors going up against the OKC and we're talking about this rebuilding OKC team that only has a wash up Chris Paul playing around with Steven Adams, Dennis Shooter, Ferguson and Diablo whatever his name is and look what happened the Warriors big all star with Russell, Jim and Greg Curry are getting smacked in the second half but are tanking OKC 530 points though so right now the score is 37, 71, 70 and do you know how embarrassing it is that the Warriors' new big three with Gilo is getting smacked by a rebuilding OKC team at the Cheesecake Factory? Like how embarrassing it is that um, without Clay Thompson, without Iggy, without Katie, without Boogie, you guys are getting smacked really badly now. All you motherfuckers, you can say like, you know, yeah, this is one game, two games, you know, but that's not only acceptable. Like in the second half, the score is thirty-seven seventy, and OKC is winning by dirty. And you're losing to a rebuilding team, which is the OKC with a wash up Chris Paul, Ferguson, Adams and shit, when they don't have even Russell Paul George anymore. Like, like Jesus Christ, like, come on, man. Like, I haven't got proof right here. Like, you can believe me right now, but. Yeah, it's too blurry, so you can't really see it. But I'm just letting you know um, the OKC, dude, they're not supposed to win this game overall by that much, though. I expect OKC to win because it's their home court and they got Chris Paul, but Warriors having 37, OKC having 70, and they're right now losing by 32 to this rebuilding team. Like, come on, man. Like, that's just unacceptable, you know? Like, that shows you that the Warriors, dude, they really miss Kevin Durant. They really miss Klay Thompson. Without their defense or offense, dude, they ain't nothing but net, dude. Even Pat Beverly was right. He's like, okay, I see you. You guys are different without KD, you know. Everyone knows that this going to the Warriors team, they're going to miss the playoffs, dude. And I want to hear all those delusional Warriors fans that keep on saying, oh, it's one game, we're going to make the playoffs, this and that. But how are you going to make the playoffs if you're losing by 32 to this tanking old-ass OKC team? Like, come on, man. These Warriors fans, like, they have to admit the fact that their dynasty is over. They're not going to playoffs this year without Clay D, without Kevin Durant, without Boogie, without Iguodala. You ain't going any further, though, so... As an update, by the way, um, the new addition of Glenn Robinson had one point. Jamal Green had five points. Russell Ford, Curry has ten points. Jeez, like all of them, like, are not really having a good game at all. I don't know what's up with that, but just letting you know, OKC, that's not a playoff team, and they're still smacking the Warriors. So just imagine this Warriors from going against Lakers, Clippers, or Milwaukee would be worse. But anyways, um, that's a quick update. So peace out.